Hello and welcome to all about YouTube channel. So today we are going to learn about what is a test manager and how you can connect a test manager to your, your path studio. Okay, so before going to this connection, I will tell you a brief about your path test manager. So your path test manager is our web application that allows you to easily manage your testing process by addressing the following functional areas. Assigning automation from Studio Pro to test cases. So it means there should be a connection between Studio and the test manager. Okay. So if you need to uh, pass the test cases from Studio to uh, the cloud or the web application UI for test manager, there should be a connection. Okay. So that part we are going to cover today. Then assign test cases to requirements. Dashboard to get a quick overview of your results. Then you can report uh, the total execution of your test suite. Then manual testing, like you can create the manual test cases and if, if there is any requirement that you need to upload uh, in the UI part uh, test manager, that also you can keep for the reference, okay. Then creating defects from test results. So after the execution, and if you want to connect that with the different uh, ticketing tool like ServiceNow or Jira, there are plugins available. You can connect that to uh, those uh, applications and you can raise the tickets over there. Okay, so uh, UiPath Test Manager is uh, uh, it's like a, a container which help you to uh, do the overall uh, management of your test execution. Okay, so it will help to uh, upload the test cases from studio to uh, 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 test manager. Also, you can add the requirement documents. Also, you can create the manual test cases. And if there is any supporting documents needs to be uploaded and need to keep as part of the test execution, you can uh, keep it over there for uh the review purpose also uh, for uh, reporting like uh, it, it will generate the reports of the test execution uh, also it will help to raise the defects by content to different applications okay so that is the purpose of ui path the test manager so i will tell you brief uh, more about uh, this ui path test manager in the coming video so uh, we are planning to uh, give an overview of the entire functionalities of test manager and uh, we will be creating a sample test case and I will show you how to upload the test case and uh, we can see how to add the requirements and how to generate the uh, uh, dashboard overview and the reports everything will be covered in the coming videos okay so before do that we have to connect the test manager to our UiPath studio that's what we are going to cover today okay so I hope you got a clear understanding about UiPath test manager okay so let me go to orchestrator so here you can see a um, entity called test manager right so we have to click on that suppose if, if it is not available in your machine <coughs> what you have to do is go to more go to admin okay here go to uh, tenant city here you here you need to enable this particular service okay you need to enable this test manager as service then only you will be able to see it in the uh, service panel okay so currently uh, I have enabled that that's why uh, uh, I am able to see the service over here click on that test manager and if I go to UiPath studio and uh, uh, I already created a uh, <coughs> test uh, project called test automation demo and if I uh, open the UiPath studio uh, and when I click on test manager uh, <coughs> button over here it will ask to uh, manager uh, settings then click on that then it will open up a window like this okay project setting then click on test manager configuration okay but here it is showing like it's not connected to any test manager instances okay so here you need to pass the test manager instance uh, url and you need to connect it okay so this is same like how you are connecting the orchestrator orchestrator to a robot okay so uh, you are going to connect your studio to a test manager so I will tell you how to get the uh, test manager link. <laughs> so when I go to test manager, here you can see this is the URL, right? So let me copy it from uh, my uh, uh, domain name, then after test manager underscore, right? So let me copy that. Uh, go to test manager uh, URL, then give connect. Okay, now you can see it is connected. Okay, 
So it means this particular URL which we copied is a valid one and it has connected to the test manager instance. Okay. So this is how you need to uh, connect to uh, the test manager. And here you can see I created a uh, project and uh, these are different functionalities which we uh, we can get from test manager uh, uh, service. Okay. So it will provide a dashboard. It, uh, we can add up the requirement documents or we can create the uh, requirements. Also, uh, we can add up the test cases, okay, which we are uh, uploading from uh, studio. Also, we can create the test sets. Also, the test uh, result will get appropriate here. And the project settings, like uh, if, if you need to connect that to different uh, ticketing tools like uh, Jira or uh, ServiceNow or Webhook or S uh, SRA server, like that, it is offering different connections of plugins. So, through this, you can connect to different service for raising the bugs. Okay, so that is an overview about the UiPath Test Manager, and uh, we have learned how you can connect the Test Manager instance to the UiPath Studio. Okay, so that's all for today. We will be covering the uh, other topics in the coming uh, videos. So please do subscribe and uh, uh, wait for the next videos. Bye.